Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you guys how to make a white bass fly. Walleye fly or any fly in general, it's pretty simple. Um, this is just the way that I do it. I need a few materials. Here you're going to need a, a bobbin, which is this metal piece here. Um, some thread, you can find it any local um, sporting goods store that sells fly making materials. And material thread finisher and a clamp. Uh, hooks you can use any size you want. I choose to use the size six. Uh, just eagle claw plain hooks, nothing special. And last but not least, the vise. So what you want to do is you're gonna put the hook in the vise, make sure it's secure. Thread in the thread through the bobbin hole then out the top. You're going to want to start wrapping from the top here to the down the sh shaft of the hook. I go about three quarters of the way down and then I work my way back up. Towards the top of the eyelet, and then I just let this dangle down. Um, you can choose any color bucktail you can find. I have purple here, uh, red. You can also throw in some shiny material so it flex in water, or whichever one you like. And today I'm just going to do a red one here. So you're just going to Anywhere on the bucktail you can take some hair off. I usually go towards the back end, back here a little bit more. I just, just pinch off uh, maybe like an inch and a half worth of bucktail here and cut it off. Once you have it like this, I'd put it in a bundle. Um, if it's not even like this, you can always take the scissors and cut it to make it even. Just want to continue pinching it and place it over the hook. And then you're going to start wrapping again here. This is going to be the shape of the head of the fly. Depending on how many wraps you do, uh, that's going to determine the diameter of the head. I usually just keep going until all of the excess colored bucktail is out of the area. And then finishing tool part here. What you're gonna do is oh, hook this part here down through the bottom. And you're gonna make a figure four like that. You're gonna go one, two. Three, four times, and you're going to want to pull this down. That's going to slip off the end of here. Pull it tight, and then you're just going to cut the excess thread. Uh, you can finish the head with some cement, clear cement. You can also find that at the local sporting goods store. Uh, paint some eyes on there, do whatever you want, and then you can take this out of the vise and that's your final product 
Again, you can use any color you want, purple, red, mix a combination of colors. It's up to you. Uh, if you guys have any questions, leave it in the comment section below and I'll try my best to answer. Thanks, guys.